If we are told the coefficient of determination is r squared equals 0 0.928, can we know what r is just by taking the square root? If not, why? Assume simple linear regression was done with one predictor variable x. All right, so they're asking, can we know r if we have r squared? And the answer is no, we cannot. So the more complicated answer is that the reason why we can't know it is even though if we have r squared, we can certainly take the square root of r squared and say that r is equal to the square root of r squared. We can do that, but the problem is that what we really find out here is the absolute value of r. So let's figure out what that is first, and then we'll talk about that. So the square root of r squared here is 0.928. Close it up, hit enter, and we get the answer 0 0.9633 dot dot dot, right? So approximately 0 0.963. Okay, so we know that the answer for absolute value of r is 0 0.963 but we don't know if r is equal to negative 0 0.963 or if r is equal to positive 0 0.963. That's a mystery. We don't know which one is true. And the reason why we don't know which one is true is because obviously any number squared is going to be positive. So if they had taken this number and squared it, they would have gotten 0.928. Just like if they took this number and squared it, they would have gotten 0.928. So essentially, there's no way to know if all we know is r squared. We have to have something else that lets us know whether r is negative or positive. One of the things that you can look for is the slope. If the slope is negative, then r is negative. If the slope is positive, then r is positive. So that's one of the things that gives it away. Or even the mixed term, sum of squares x, y, if that term is negative, then r will be negative. If that term is positive, r is positive. So of course, but if we don't have that information, we have no way to know for sure what r actually is. We can say that its absolute value, though, is 0.963. And that indicates a strong linear relationship. We just don't know whether it's a strong negative linear relationship or a strong positive linear relationship.